TNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN at 10 a.m. Eastern Time, 30 minutes into the trading day. And we got volatility in both directions already, folks. The market at 7 a.m. trading at 43.70. We trade up all the way to almost 44.20 at 9 a.m. this morning. And we've given up 20 points since then. Market trading right near 4,400. You're positive by four tenths percent in the S&P. NASDAQ 100 up 25 right now. Make it 37. You're up a quarter percent at 14,273. We Again, give up some of the gains that we had earlier this morning. Dow up 180. You got the Russell, only major index in negative territory. And boy, you talk about volatility, man. Russell just gives up 30 points or a percent and a half from where you were at 9 a.m. Commodities, we got some serious volatility, man. That crude market, whoo. 116.57, folks, you're talking about prices we haven't seen in like 14 years in the crude market. And then just like that, you get a sell off from 115 down to a level of 106.43. You're back to 110 right now. Uh, all the volatility having to do with Russian energy. Uh, you had a comment out there um, from an official in Germany saying maybe they weren't ready to do that quite yet. That eased some of the pain in the crude market, but man, it ain't over, and that gonna be, ain't gonna be over anytime soon with volatility in the energy market over there. Uh, you back down to notes and bonds, man. And this is quite the volatility as well. We're sitting flat right now on your 10-year we're trading with a yield right now in the 10-year at 1.878 percent so about 1.88 percent the yield on the 10-year boy we were at 1.7 percent uh not that long ago in terms of early early yesterday huge moves in the yields we jump around to some of the companies that have earnings this morning we jumped to best buy they're trading higher up 9.5 percent uh, I went over their numbers on my program last hour. Some mixed numbers in there in terms of some misses, but seems like their forecast and optimism of the years to come of exceeding pandemic levels in terms of exceeding the pandemic uh, highs that they reached for revenue and earnings, the market liking that. Uh, and on the flip side of it, we got some companies trading lower. You got big lots, they claw back some of those lower losses. You're uh, down only eight tenths percent after trading at 35 going to be an interesting day as it's been folks lots of uh, volatility to put it lightly in this market our man basil chapman did his program at eight o'clock this morning that's coming up right now you have larry pesvento live at 11 a.m eastern time folks fast market at 12 they're talking boeing they're talking marvel technologies along with another equity in there steve rhodes dave white tom o'brien this afternoon thanks so much folks have a great thursday